So I was scrolling on the, you know, little Uzi Vert, um, I guess Reddit, Twitter, forum page, and you know, I just love going into these these rap communities and stuff, and just being able to like relay with other people, especially with music and stuff like that. So this guy named Season Off Season A talks about his favorite little Uzi Vert songs on each album. So. I'm gonna just do the exact same thing and just make my list and then you can just join along with me and but first of all I'm just gonna rank his you know what I mean like if it's W or an L so off Love is Rage he put the song right now and I'm gonna say that's a W I would say right now it's like 8.5 out of 10 and then Little Uzi Vera vs. The World, he chose Grab the Wheel, which is also a W. I, w I would say this is a 10 out of 10 song. It's just like a perfect Uzi song. Perfect, like, chill, melodic Uzi song. You just can't go wrong with that one. Next is a perfect love tape, and he chose You're Lost. And, man, I'm an Uzi stan, so I'm off to say it's a W. Like, literally every single song I can see here right now, it's like all Ws, but... I'm gonna put W and your loss is about probably say like an 8.5 out of 10 as well. And then for a little Uzi Universal World 2, this is from the deluxe and you chose loaded. And loaded is oh, I almost said 10, but I'm gonna go with 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10. 9.5 out of 10. It's like no, I'm going with the 10. It's a perfect Uzi song as well. So that's a W. For Eternal Take, he chose Vignetta. That one's honestly probably my favorite off of little um, Eternal Take. Out to W as well. And I give this one a 10 out of 10 as well. Like, like I said, I'm an Uzi stand. This is perfect Uzi song for that style of music that he was going for. And then for a little Uzi vs. The World 2, he chose Lotus. And this one, I'm going to go with an L. I think Lotus is like... 5.5 out of 10. I wasn't the biggest fan of the mixing and just kind of the song structure of it and the snippet when he was in Young Thug's Instagram Live and just he had like the super feminine look. He had like the ponytail with the, the dreadlocks and the braces and the snippet just sounded better than the release song. Off of, off of Pluto versus Baby Pluto, I Don't Want to Break Up. That's a pretty good one. Um, I'm gonna go with an L on this one to be real with you. I give this one like, uh, like I don't wanna break up. Da, 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 da. I'll give it a 7 out of 10. That's a good one. Red and White flicks up. Um, I think the original snippet was um, Wheelchair, I think. Flex Up is like great Uzi song. It's like a grail sound song. It's just perfect. Um, I'm going to give it um, I'll give this one an 8. I like it. I like it. It's not quite I would say it's like a 9 10 category. I just haven't had the, the relationship with the song enough to be like, yo, this is like, this is my favorite. And now for Pink Tape Pluto to Mars. And recently I've been listening to Pink Tape a lot more. I've been, you know, like the, the seasons are changing a little bit. The weather's a little bit different. I've been more into my emotions a little bit. So like, I think Pluto Mars is a 10 and this is a W. So now it's gonna be my turn to do this. And we'll just start an order from how it is on Google. Hopefully I don't dox myself. So let's just go to the full track list of the Pink Tape, show more. Um, so it's gonna be in between for my favorite. I'm just gonna choose my favorite for today. Like it's gonna change. I'll do this like many different times. But for today, I'm gonna go with Mama. I'm sorry. I've been vibing to this like Mama. I'm sorry. Just all week. I mess with it heavy. It's close with Mama. I'm sorry and Pluto to Mars. And I know both of those were highly anticipated snippets, but they're just too damn good. Okay, let's go to the next one. And that guy chose uh, Pluto to Mars, by the way. So next is Love is Rage 2, and this one changes so much because this is like one of my favorite Uzi projects ever and one of my favorite albums ever, but for today, I'm going to go with No Sleep Leak, and this is a 10 out of 10 track, and I believe the Season 08 or whatever this guy's name was, he chose um, Loaded, which is also a W, but No Sleep Leak just has a 
special place in my heart and pretty mommy is like right up there as well it's like the, the same sample and beat just like flip backwards which is probably why i like it so much you know but like there's just so many tens on this project all right so next on this list is little uziver versus the world and i think it's gonna be around the same the same as what this guy chose with grab the wheel so let's just go to the track list i'm just gonna like i know it's grab the wheel but i just want to go to the, the track list yeah it's grab the wheel which is a 10 like i said before so let's let's go to the next project eternal take and eternal take is kind of an underrated Uzi project i mean maybe not in a sense just because it was just so big when like the the pandemic first started and everybody was like at school and stuff like that but i am already know what it is and it's vignetta it's the same as this guy so this guy's a w list vignetta 10 out of 10 track i was listening to eternal take yesterday and i come to realize there's like no skips on here really except chrome heart tags i don't like and where's the other one uh urgency those are the only two i don't like so this is like a pretty quality project but let's go to love is rage and he chose right now for Love is Rage. I'm gonna go with, uh, this is just like my, my choosing of today though. Uh, I'm gonna go with Ballin. Ballin's a 10 out of 10 for me and it's just like, just the vibe to it. It's just like, so, so pure, man. Like Ballin. I was gonna say Yamber, uh, Yamborghini Dream, but it's just like, it's not enough Uzi. It's kind of like the, the Yeet song with Young Thug, like on my wrist. It's mostly this Young Thug and less Yeet, so it's like, I can't really count it. Or it'd either be banned from TV, because I love that one too. Um, let's see what's what's next on the list. Little Uzi Vera vs. World 2. And at one point, I know this guy chose, this guy chose Lotus. But I'm gonna go with, um, it's, it's, it's gonna be Myron. Myron's like one of my all-time favorite Uzi songs and it's just like You just can't go wrong with Myron. It's just like when you think of an Uzi song. I think of Myron, you know, I just remember the snippet coming out like I think it was two years before Eternal I Take Drop, maybe three and he was like dancing in a big window behind him And he was just like vibing and dancing and that one's easily It's a 10 out of 10 easily in my top 10 favorite Uzi songs but I don't know if I could give you a top 10 Uzi songs. I'd have to look at my analytics. You know what I mean? Because like sometimes it's like different. Like sometimes there's like some songs where it just sounds um, so pleasuring to the ears. I don't want to over listen to it and like overextend the experience. And other times it's just like, yo, like I listen to like the track just like so many damn times that it's like my favorite. So it's just like a bunch of different ways to how to really rank things. But let's go to the perfect love tape. I think for him, what did he do for the perfect love tape? Perfect love tape. He did your lost. And that one's a 10 too, but I'm gonna go with like this one is probably like one of my least favorite Uzi projects, but it's like there's literally no misses. But for today, I'm gonna go with do what I want. Normally it would be I can drive, but like for whatever reason, I just been listening to "Do What I Want" a lot. Probably just because it's in my my playlist, you know, my November 2023 playlist. So it's just like it's just one that I really listen to a lot. And I know that's like kind of a typical answer because that's like the most popular song in there. But straight up, it's a banger. All right, next on the list is Pluto, baby Pluto, and this one, this project gets a lot of unnecessary hate. I do like it. And I don't like it at the same time. So I'm going to go with my... F it's, such, it's still a fire project. It's like a seven at least. And it's like with Future. But I'm going to go with... She never been a Pluto. It just sounds like a straight up Uzi evolved song. What he's supposed to sound like. And it's a ten. And I know this guy did... Um, Which one did he do for... He did I Don't Want to Break Up. And that one's pretty good too. But, uh, okay, let's see where we're at next. Next we have the red and white tape. I remember this guy did uh, Flex Up. Um, um, 
I already know what it is. It's already for fun, man. I know this is kind of like the typical answer because it is the most popular on the project and probably the best on the project by most people that are Uzi fans kind of consider. But for fun, it's just like it's such a good Uzi song. It's just incredible. You know what I mean? Like, I almost want to make like a bracket or something like this and redo this, redo this video just to make it more pleasantly aesthetic. But yeah, for fun. It'd be kind of it'd be kind of fun to do like a little bracket of the best song for each project and see which one is the best, you know? Because it does change on a daily for me. Okay, let's go to the last project. Um, last one is ten seventeen versus the world, and this one is probably one I don't really go back to that much, but I think it's probably O four, O four. It's probably my favorite and. Uh, 1017 versus the world but uh, honestly all the songs kind of slap I remember when it first came out it was when I was first getting into Uzi you know what I mean but yeah let me know in the comments what's your guys' favorite Uzi song from each project for today maybe not in general because like if you're a big Uzi fan it's going to change on the daily but yeah let me know